So let's look at tuning the guitar. There are a few methods to use for tuning, but the easiest one has to do with finding a note on the fifth fret of the guitar and playing the adjacent string lower. So let's look at that method for today. The, uh, to get the, to tune the A string, what you're going to do is count up to the fifth fret on the low E string. One, two, three, four, five. And then put your index finger on that note, which is A. It's the note A on the low E string. And then you'll play that. And then you're going to play the open A string, the fifth string. And those pitches should be the same. So you can try that. Put your index finger on the fifth fret of the low E string and play. And then play the open A string. And play those at the same time. You should get the same pitch or the same sound. Now, you'd use a similar method to get the D string, the fourth string, in tune. What you'll do is you'll go to the fifth fret of the fifth string. That's the A string, the fifth string. One, two, three, four, five. Put your index finger down on the fifth fret of the fifth string, and that's actually fretting the note D. And then you're going to play the open string on the fourth string, and that's D. So you'll play the D here on the fretted fifth fret of the A string, and then you'll play the open string, and then you can play them both together to check. Now let's go to tuning the third string, that's the G. So we're going to use a similar method, we're going to count up one, two, three, four, five, from the G, the, to the G note on the D string, that's the fourth string, fifth fret of your guitar, and that's the note G. And then you're going to play the open string, the G. So it'll sound like this. Both together. And then, one more time, simultaneously. You should have the same pitch or same note. If you don't, you have to adjust the tuning knobs at the top of your guitar. Okay, for the B, it's going to change the system a little bit. You're going to want to go to the fourth fret. So one, two, three, four. Go up to the fourth fret and then play that. No, that's going to be a B on the G string, on the third string of the guitar. So this is slightly different. This time we're going to be on the fourth fret of the third string rather than the fifth fret. So you play that note, that's the note B, and then you're going to play the open string B. And then play them together. Okay, and then we'll go to tune the E string. That's your high E string. We're going to go back to the fifth fret here now of the B string. So one, two, three, four, five, fifth fret. Play that. And those pitches should be the same. So you can play those at the same time. Okay. And then to tune the low E string to check it, you can go to the seventh fret of the A string. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's the seventh fret of the fifth string. And that's going to be the note E, but it's going to be an octave higher than the low E string. So this is the sound of the fretted note E on the fifth string of the guitar. And then this is the sound of the open low E string. So you can hear they're one octave apart. So you're going to want to play those two to check and then you can play them together. And you should be good to go.